Hi guys, good afternoon. So this is Arlene from the Philippines. And as you can see, I'm outside today. Actually, I'm still here in Lipa City, Batangas because I'm showing you a one hectare farm lot with a nice house actually. And it's very nice because for me, because this property is 2.1 kilometers away from Balete Exit Startall and three and between, if I'm not mistaken, like three kilometers away from SNR and it's in ara it's in like five kilometer radius away from uh, hospitals schools and churches and grocery stores so this property is very ideal and before i forget i want to thank all my subscribers for continuously supporting my channel thank you so much guys so if you haven't subscribed to my video and to my channel please do because it really helps fund my scholarship program for college and high school students okay so let's check the property so this is the cemented barangay road so as i told you this property is very close to ballet exit and snr shopping mall plus all the uh, schools and universities prominent in lipa city batanga so this will be your neighbor okay and this is already the property so the property starts right here where you can see the wall okay and that is the electric and internet connection so there is water electricity and internet connections in the area and of course you can see already the property is already fenced or wall actually wall and the frontage of the property is 45 meter long so this is the property this property is actually cut by another barangay road on its back so later i gonna show you that part of the video part of the property which is cut so this is the internet connection and it's very quiet here and what i really like about this is close proximity to everything so and if you will go a little bit higher you can see there's a mountain over there okay and you don't have a neighbor in the front so that makes you uh, a very clear uh, view of the mountain if you're in the house and of course less no noise right so it's very good and let's go inside and of course look this property is very nice because i love all these coconut trees so let me take a picture of that so you can see the this property is ideal because you have the walled uh, fence property actually with the house and on the back you have the the property only with the fence and that includes all the fruit bearing trees and on this part we will go and check the house okay it's very nice i love it So let's check the border on this side. So we have here fruit bearing trees as well. So pomelo, lanzones, that one is durian, coconut trees, guyabano, banana trees. Okay, on this side. This is actually fence, but you can see already the house. So the house as well, it's elevated. And the elevation of this property, if you ask me, is 260 meter above sea level. So that is the house later, we're gonna check on it, okay? So that will be the last. So the owner is cleaning the house. Let's go here first. Okay, so I will go up here. So we have a lot of rambutan trees. Okay. And 
I think they have some chicken. Yes, they have some chicken over here, a rooster. And over here as well, some chickens. And you can see it's completely fenced, okay? So this is the side of the property which is fenced. And let's check the... Oh, they have the brown chicken. Okay. Wow, look at that. It's quite windy here. Very nice. And over here, you have, oh, this one is citrus actually. And look, there is still some fruit. And here, you have the small gate. Okay, as I'm telling you, that is the extension or another continuation of this one hectare property divided by the uncemented barangay road. So that's why this property has sort of three axes so let's check on this side so here the wall ends okay so the wall ends and it's going now with with the nets and it's lined with mahogany trees so on this point i can see all the coconut trees and all other fruit bearing trees in the area so this one is durian so if you are familiar with it it's very nice we have here okay guyabano tree and citrus it's really nice guys one of the nicest properties i have been in lipa of course this is actually it's sort of like like creating an irony for me because you know you are close to the city proper but at the same time you are living the provincial life so here this used to be a stall for the pigs but there's no pigs anymore so that is like uh, i think three buildings let me take back so you can see clearly okay so yeah and that is where the wall ends actually over here and over there we have the dog and here if you are fond of dragon fruit we have dragon fruit as well and again another mango uh, no durian so very nice and some chickens so this is the house guys Okay, let's check the inside, guys. So guys this is the house actually located in this one hectare property and actually it's very nice because uh yeah you just have to clean it a little bit so on the back we have the aircon over there and of course it's already span drill perfect the aircon is newly installed. Oh. 
Ah, centralized pa. Okay. The aircon is centralized. Wow, look. Nako tatanggal ko ang sapatos. Wag na, wag na. No, hindi ho. Wag na at Okay, so yeah. This is a house good for a family of four. So you have uh -huh. nice kitchen. Wow. Very nice. Okay. And here we have the bath. Look. It's the shower. And here is the toilet. Okay. And you have the powder room over here. Very nice. And this is your circuit breaker. Kuya ang ganda. Yes po. Dalo ang kwarto niya. So you have two bedrooms over here. Can I see? Okay. Bedroom one. And bedroom two. Bedroom two. Ano kahit kasi ah? Sama eh, puro ano, puro gamit. It's okay. Hindi ka mo ginagamit yung bahay. Yeah, the house is not been used. So it's so guys uh, as I told you before this one hectare property is divided by a five meter barangay road so this one is the first half of the property okay and this one to my right is the second half of the property and the frontage on this side is 58 meter long so let's check okay So this property is ideal because you have like uh, three access or actually yeah three access point. So in front of the house on the side of the house this one you have the small gate okay and on the side where you have this undeveloped farm. So as I told you before this property is very good because it is two kilometers away from Balete exit. Uh, Balete exit Startol and 2.8 kilometers away from SNR and you are also close to University of Patangas, De La Salle and all the private school here and 45 minutes to 1 hour travel time from here to Metro Manila. So this is the border actually and it's all going down over there and this is the side to the house okay that's it it's very nice guys so this property is accessible to everything and of course you have a lot of fruit bearing trees in the area and water electricity and internet connections are available so over here this is a small hut by the caretaker but don't worry about it the owner will be the one who will handle that one and this property is full of trees so on the border you have the mahogany trees okay and jackfruit and of course my favorite coconut trees and lansones kuya makikibidyo lang po okay so a lot it's very nice guy So let's go around here. So this property has a lot of fruit bearing trees. So we have here pomelo, lansones, coconut trees. This one is jackfruit, a lot of banana trees and coconut trees it's really nice guys so if you are interested in farm lots with already fruit bearing trees on it this is ideal guys because you don't have to plant anymore all you have to do is pay and harvest its fruit it's really nice and of course i can see they have been harvesting a lot of coconut trees because of the coconut husk so really that's a lot and i was informed that the border of this property is also the creek and the elevation of this property is 270 270 meter above 
sea level. So if you're wondering, all those mahogany trees, that is the border to the neighbor side, okay? And over here, the metal sheet. So you have clear indication of the borders over here. So perfect. And it's this one is completely flat. It's not like other properties like you get the high one and then it's sloping down. This one is flat 100%. I love it. Oh, okay. And they also have these peppercorns. I love very much. Perfect, guys. I love this. You know, when you are cooking and you got the fresh peppercorns, that is priceless for me. It's all organic. Wow. And it's quite windy here. Very nice, guys. Love it, love it, love it. So, a lot of banana trees. And lansones trees. So, lansones, that one, that one. You know, but you, of course, you have to take care of that. You have to prune it in that way. And, of course, my favorite portinola chili peppers or siling labuyo in Tagalog. You're only missing the, uh, sorry, the native chicken. Oops. Okay. Perfect, guys. I love it. So now I'm here at the end of the property. So as I told you, that is the border on the side, okay? With the metal sheet. And it's bordered, as I told you, by mahogany trees. So you have, oh, look, look at that. A saba. It's already ripe, but no one is harvesting it. And a very nice coconut tree with lots of fruit. And this is your border, actually. So you have the bamboo trees you can use it to make your bahay kubo if you like or for planting purposes as well i love this wow this is very nice property nice 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 let's go to the other side and it's really elevated so there's a small creek but there is no water and with high elevation you can expect that especially in the months of September to January, it's a little bit chilly here and quite windy. That's why Lipa properties, they are sought after because of the cool climate after Baguio, which is number one. And the second one is Tagaytay. And over here, look, we still have Lansones trees. So you can still have that because that's still part of the property. Oh, I saw some chickens, guys. Time to catch. Time to catch some chickens. Okay, so this is the border, guys. So, mahogany trees all the way up. So, you really have a clear indication of the borders. Very nice, guys. I super love this property. There's a lot of return of investment here, especially, guys, especially, you know, according to BIR update, zonal update, the prices of this property, especially here in Lipa, are increasing dramatically or drastically. So you can get your return of investment, not in three years or five years. The moment you made some improvements, you sell it, and then you already have your return of investment. Very nice. Ang ganda nito! One of the nicest property guys in Lipa that I have seen. Perfect.
so guys just to sum it up this one hectare property has a house on it with actually water electricity and internet connection it has a complete wall on one side and on the other side you have the the farm lot okay which is on the other side of the road and it has a lot of fruit bearing trees uh, coconut trees rambutan durian lansones papaya uh, bananas and even the house has like uh, two rooms one toilet one bath one living room and one kitchen which is perfect for a family of four or five depending on how ma how many you like it and yeah this is a very nice property because it's close to start all to schools to groceries snr churches and everything so thank you so much guys stay safe bye so guys if you are interested in this one hectare property with wall and actually house on it with another uh, property actually on the back this property is for sale for 45 million pesos negotiable and uh, you can send email at only.arlina.gmail.com or you can visit my facebook page at arlini bandolski or you can send sms viber whatsapp or telegram at 0917-621-4090 or 0998-574-7194 thank you so much guys for watching stay safe have a nice day thank you bye